welcome back to another episode of the Worst Possible Commander Show. It's me, it's CGB, and this is our first show featuring cards from Kamigawa, Neon Dynasty, it's upside down. That's okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, special thanks to CoolStuffInc.com, our sponsor for this show. Make sure that you leave a comment. The winner of this game is going to choose their favorite comment from the comment section to receive a Cool Stuff Inc. gift code for $50 to their site. So, thank you, CoolStuffInc.com. And our version of Rule Zero here is we talk about the absolute worst thing that our decks can do to each other to kind of mentally and emotionally prepare for the carnage that's going to ensue. So, I am playing this new commander, Hinata the Dawn Crowned from Kamigawa Neon Dynasty. It makes all of my spells cost one less. It makes all of your spells that, cost, that target cost one more. I get a one mana reduction actually for each target. So the worst things I can probably do are cast big spells like Magma Opus and Sublime Epiphany for only like two mana. And I do have a card in my deck, Soulfire Grandmaster, that for four mana can let me, every time I cast it, get it back. So, in theory, I can eventually just be casting these spells over and over until you're really sick of me. So, that's what's going on with my deck. Blake! Well, like everyone else, I'm sure, I was super hyped to see the new shrines. So I built a shrine deck uh, with Goshin Tie of Life's Origin, which is a 4-mana 3-4 shrine creature. And I can pay Wooburg and tap it to return an enchantment from my graveyard to the battlefield. And whenever this or another non-token shrine enters the battlefield, I make a 1-1 colorless shrine enchantment creature token. I think the worst thing I could do in this deck is resolve a Starfield of Nyx, which turns all of my enchantments into creatures, and just tap things sideways and kill everybody. I hate shrines. I'm just going on the record, that's all. Shrines that's, are exciting. I, I mean, I, look, real-life shrines are cool. I've, I've seen some before, but th these shrines... There's so many. That's okay. why I decided to sit next to you. Nice. This game. <laughs> cool. I I'm so happy that. about this. Me. Just stay off my play mat. Ben, you, you, you have decided to bring a commander that's just on its own the worst possible. What are you doing to us? Yes, I am playing the new Jin Gataxia's Progress Tyrant. And he, whenever I cast an artifact instant or sorcery spell, I can copy it. Uh, and I may choose new targets for the copy. It only triggers once each turn. But even better yet, uh, whenever an opponent casts an artifact instant or sorcery spell, I can counter that spell, and it only triggers once a turn as well. But just the worst thing I can do is just boost my mana a lot early game and just play my commander until I win. Essentially. <laughs> so yeah, ninety nine islands and jink attacks. Mm, yeah, exactly. so let's go. Mm. All right, Shay. What have what have you brought from Kamigawa Neon Dynasty, and what's the worst thing it can do to us? Yeah, so I'm playing a Mardu Attack Triggers deck, and I have Ishin, two heavens as one, as my commander. Um, so, this is a human samurai, and if a creature attacking causes a triggered ability of a permanent you control to trigger, that ability triggers an additional time. Um, so I think the worst possible thing that my deck will or could do to you all is um, if I can get Atali out or Sun Titan out uh, along with my commander, it's just like attack triggers everywhere, swinging in with creatures, doing lots of damage. Um, yeah. I'd be pretty scared of Atali triggering off that thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. The, the deck, you might yeah. have more, you might get the best of all of our decks right there on the spot. <laughs> she might play more dinosaurs this game than last game. All right, guys. <laughs> I won the dine roll. Right here, this guy won the die roll, so Covert Go Rigged. Let's dive in. <laughs> Let the game begin. I'll draw and fun. Start, I'm already like looking at this hand like I've got too many lands that do too many things. So, we're going to play Shatter Skull Smashing tapped as a Shatter Skull the Hammer Pass done. Draw for turn. I will play a command tower and pass. Okay. I'll draw for turn. Yeah. I'll play the Meriden's Core as my first land for the game. I can tap it and add a colorless, or I can tap it and put a charge counter on it. And then later I can tap and remove a charge counter and add one mana of any color to my mana pool. And I have nothing to do with this. Well, you've changed. Actually, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, actually, 
I do have something to do this turn. I will suspend a Lotus Bloom with three oh, suspend God. counters okay. on it for zero. And then I will, since I have nothing else to do, I will tap this to put a charge counter on it. So, Jenga taxes three turns earlier. Let's yeah. go. <laughs> and I will pass my turn. Okay. Drop a turn. I'm going to play a Blood Crypt, which will enter tapped, and I'll pass the turn. Untap, draw. Untapped spectator seating. It's a red white land. And I will cast Soulfire Grandmaster. This is a 2 2 lifelink. Instant and sorcery spells I control have lifelink. And for two and a blue red or a blue red, I can, the next time I cast an instant or sorcery from my hand, instead of putting it in the graveyard as it resolves, I return it to my hand. This is. I might have been alluding to this as the way I could just keep getting my spells back. Anyway, mm -hmm. your turn. No big deal. All right, I will play the prettiest forest you've actually ever seen and cast a Talisman of Dominance and pass my turn. Okay. I will untap and draw, or actually, before I draw, I will remove a Suspend County. The new lands from Kamigawa oh. are lovely. Oh. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. The swamp's mm -hmm. the best. I'll play an island, I will tap two, play an arcane signet, and I will pass. <laughs> Anybody else concerned? <laughs> yes. It's mono ramp. <laughs> mono ramp, yeah. Scary. In blue. Draw for turn. Okay, gonna play a marsh flats. I will tap it and pay a life, and then go search my library for a plains or swamp card, and then put it onto the battlefield, and then shuffle my library. So, I will put Marsh Flats into the graveyard and I retrieve a Sacred Foundry. I'm gonna lose two life so it doesn't enter the battlefield tapped. And then I'm gonna tap two here to play Orzhov Signet. And then I'll pass the turn. Oh, untap, draw, we'll play Mystic Gate, which I can tap for a colorless or I can make combinations of white and blue with. And I'm going to cast Teferi Time Raveler. And this is, well, you probably know, but for loyalty plus one, until your next turn you may cast sorcery spells as though they had flash. Minus three, return up to one artifact creature or enchantment to its owner hand and draw a card. And each opponent can cast spells only when they could cast a sorcery. And I don't know what you're thinking, I just want this to be around when this Lotus Bloom tries to resolve because it means that it won't be able to, yes, right? Yes, it does prevent resolution. So I'm, I, I want to, I just want this around long enough to deramp then. That is the plan. How dare you. So we need to keep it on the board for one like round of the table until this comes off suspend. And then, I'm, so I'm going to plus it and I'm going to attack Ben because I probably made him mad anyway <laughs> with Soulfire Grandmaster. Take two, I gain two. I will. 38. Your turn. Untap, draw. We'll play a Battlefield Forge. Tap two mana for a Herald of the Pantheon. This is a two mana two two that makes my enchantment spells cost one less to cast. And whenever I cast an enchantment spell, I gain a life. I will then tap Command Tower for a blue and play, or for a red rather, and play Sanctum of Shattered Heights. This is the first shrine of many. And it is. One mana, discard a land card or shrine card, and it deals X damage to target creature or planeswalker, or X is the number of shrines I control. Uh, I don't like that target creature or planeswalker. Oh, do you have, oh no. Well, I can't mm. wait to do that past the mm. turn so I can untap. I will untap. I will tick the Lotus Bloom down to one. Ticking to its doom. <laughs> yeah, now it is. I will draw a card. I will play a land. I will tap three and play Heraldic Banner. I will choose blue. Creatures you control of the chosen type get plus one, plus oh. I might add a mana of the chosen color. It really is just all ramp cards and changes yeah, yeah. taxes. And I will, just for no reason, tap this and go to two counters. Because why not? What are you going to do with that colored mana there, uh, Ben? You know, cast blue spells. That's cool. <laughs> blue spells are cool. All right. Draw for turn. Hmm. 
first I'll play Command Tower. I don't know how I feel about this. Four. Too many mm. good things to do. Yeah. Actually, yeah. I got options. So, it's always good. Not for us. Well, true. <laughs> but yeah. Good for the player in question. All right, gonna tap my command tower and then my Orzov Signet as well as the Blood Crypt and the Sacred Foundry. So that's four total for Ryu Storm's Edge. So this has first strike, whenever a samurai or warrior you control attacks alone, untap it. If it's the first combat phase of the turn, there is an additional combat phase after this phase. Hmm. So it's like double strike, but double attack. Okay. Yeah, pretty good. Interesting yeah. card. And then I'm going to pass the turn. All right, untap, draw. Shay. Hmm. Is that Storm's Edgy thing going to attack my, me or my Teferi? I would hate to have to bounce it out of fear. So if you could just say you'll target somebody else for one turn cycle, I won't bounce it. And it'd be a shame if something were to shrine it up. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Which I think leaves just one <laughs> Um I guess so. I can agree to that, yes. Okay. I'll plus to fairy. Goes to six loyalty. I will play Scalding Tarn, <coughs> sacrifice it, pay one life, search my library for an island or a mountain. Thank you. Thank you. Anytime. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> what a nice guy. I'm a helper. Uh, at the even, end of the day. I didn't know. I'm here to help. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna get my volcanic island sometime on camera mm. for the first time. You're welcome, internet. You're welcome, me. It's so pretty. <laughs> Stay on your own playmat. Ah, <laughs> it's so lonely. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I gotta keep an eye on this one. <laughs> yeah, you do. All right, I'm going to cast Hinata the Dawn Crown. So now spells you cast uh, that target something cost one more for each target, and spells I cast cost one less for each target. I'm going to attack Ben with my Soulfire Grand Master. So I gain two, you lose two. We'll go to the 36. Your turn, Blake. Perfect. Well on tap. I will play a slightly less cool Scalding Tarn. It really is less cool. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> Are you gonna get your volcanic island? Oh. Oh, come on. Sorry, sorry. In front of the folks at home. Sorry. Oh. <laughs> They're not gonna like that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you get a stupid triumph. Whatever, dude. The Salti triumph. Uh, Zagoth triumph. Zagoth triumph. Hey, you know, yours can make black. That's cool. That's true. It's okay. Your volcanic island can't do that. No, it can't. Make <laughs> oh, oh, better yeah, land. Right. <laughs> Confirmed. I'm going to tap three and play Sanctum of Calm Waters, which is yet another shrine. I'm going to have a little shrine shrine right here. And at the beginning of my pre-combat main phase, I can draw X cards, where X is the number of shrines I control. And if I do, I discard a card. Mm. I will gain a life off Herald of the Pantheon. Forgot that last time. I know you guys are gonna say something. And I will pass the turn. I will untap. This is gonna be wonderful. Go I'm, on. Oh, don't don't forget oh, your trigger. Is, yeah, yeah. Don't forget your trigger. Oh, I look forward to this. Oh, will be yeah. Removed. Would you like to cast it? I will attempt to. Okay. Yeah, you can't though. And oh, oh, so sad. Oh, right to exile with it. Oh, right, exile. Yeah. Yeah, never again. Take it off Even the table. Worse. We don't want that on here. <laughs> and then I will draw. That's with my Admiral Bracket Sorry. Brass in heaven. Hmm. I'll tap five and play Tamio's Journal. At the beginning of your upkeep, investigate. I can tap and sacrifice three clues and search my library for a card, put it in my hand, and then shuffle. And that will be my turn. 
As you can see, I did not play a land. I did notice. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. This is good. Yeah. I like Tamio's journal. I miss that card. It's a good card. Yeah. Drop for turn. You should have had a magnifying glass like your Sherlock Holmes. <laughs> I'm the master of props. Tapping two for Tempered and Solitude. Um, so this is an enchantment. Whenever a creature you control attacks alone, exile the top card of your library. You may play that card this turn. Then I will enter into my attack step. Um, yep, I'm going to enter my attack phase, and I will be... You can attack me. He's got enough hate. Just oh, so well, you know. Thank you. What? I appreciate the Shrine God. Yeah, the Shrine God. Are you, guys, are you trying to make friends with Jinga Taxes? Yeah, dude. <laughs> I see a Soul Fire Grandmaster out there. I've seen that card do dumb stuff with Time Walk. Are you trying to. So you can go ahead and attack me. Okay. A little suspicious, I feel like. I don't know. Just a nice guy. What do you want from me? <laughs> okay. Just a good man. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll attack you with Ryu, and it is a human samurai, so whenever a samurai or warrior you control attacks alone, untap it. So it doesn't tap to attack, is that correct? Well, well it does, but it untaps. Whoosh, whoosh. Got it. Um, so yeah, I will be attacking Blake with Ryu um, for three for strike. Trigger this, I think. Yes, and whenever a creature you control attacks, exile a top card of my library. What's, what is it? Alicia, who smiles at death. She knew she'd need those three. Yeah. <laughs> well played, Shay. Yes. Um, so, yeah, I will. Um... All right, so you're coming at me for three. Yes. No blocks. All right, so that's the first combat. That's the first combat. Second combat time. Second combat time. Remember this, Ben. I will try to. I'm garnering favor. <laughs> Um, yeah, this time I'm going to swing at Ben, I think. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, you <would> think? <laughs> Don't, didn't garner that much favor. <laughs> I, I like your style, Ben. <laughs> yeah. Um, so, yep, that's three of first strike. This time it taps, because this time uh, the untap trigger doesn't happen. And it still, yep, triggers this again. Oh, too bad you won't have the mana for the wild mage. Dang. <laughs> um, I am going to cast Alicia. Mm-hmm. Tap here, two tap this to give me two, and a red for three for Alicia. And then this will go to the graveyard? Exile. Exile. Okay, this will go to exile. All right. Pass the turn. Cool. So my plan for Teferi now, since I know everybody hates it, is I'm just going to, like, minus it for the next two turns and, like, bounce a mana rock, something that's cheap to replay and draw cards. So nobody has to hate Teferi out. I'm just going to work on getting rid of it. None of you all have to hate me, okay? Sure. <laughs> what if we hated you before? I don't Did we maintain it? <laughs> no, no, no. You like me. Oh, this is fine. True. I'm a very <laughs> diplomatic player, and you all think I'm cool. I'm going to balance the Arcane Signet to your hand and draw a card. All right, I think you're cool then. <laughs> See, that was just fine. I think fine. you're super cool. That was just fine. Then I'm going to play Clifftop Retreat untapped because I have a volcanic island. <laughs> <laughs> too much? We're rubbing no. it too much? It okay. wouldn't be too much if you let me touch it. <laughs> <laughs> oh God, there are things I would say to that if you know I weren't such a family-friendly channel. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, attack Ben for two, and I gain two life. Everyone's hating on me. I, I, I mean, I, I, like, I can't attack anybody else and risk the soul fire uh -huh. die, and I just want the life. I'm a nice guy. I'm done. You think that comment <laughs> makes you better, Dan? You're no, I was born people. better. That comment no. is, is, is <laughs> still different. All yeah. right, I will go to my first combat, my pre-combat main phase, trigger Sanctum of Calm Waters to draw two. Discard one. Calm waters, guys. Calm. Calm waters. waters. It's so calm. They're not shattered heights. They're calm <laughs> waters. <laughs> Everybody's calm. <laughs> I will discard a Satessan champion. I'm sorry, friend. You did not make the cut today. Doesn't need more cards. That's sus. Yep. Very sus. And then I will tap three mana to cast Idyllic Tutor. 
I'm going to search my library for an enchantment card, reveal it, and put it in my hand, then shuffle. Oh boy. <laughs> okay. Mr. Blue, you got anything you want to say? Mr. Other Blue? Well, uh, to fairy means I'm the only one with something to say. <laughs> but I, uh, that resolves. That's fine. Perfect. Very kind of you. It's so cool if I read your Planeswalker again. Go ahead. I need to read them. <laughs> <laughs> I need to read this card. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what Alicia thinks. She smiles at death, dude. Well, I know that. It's Damn so it. metal. It's, it's so cool. <laughs> when this who smiles at death. Is it death. really one of the. It was the bottom card of my stupid deck. <laughs> Turn target creature card with power two or less from your graveyard to the battlefield tapped and attacking. Oh, gross. That's kind of gross. When she would attack. Yeah, she oh, can geez. pay two to get it. But oh, she doesn't geez. have any power two or less in the graveyard yet, or yeah. even on the battlefield. Yeah. yeah. All right. I, with uh, Idyllic Tutor, grab Sanctum of All. This is a five mana enchantment that says at the beginning of my upkeep, I can search my library and or graveyard for a shrine and put it on the battlefield. If an ability of a shrine you control triggers when you control six or more shrines, that ability triggers an additional time. And goes in my hand. I will then shuffle and pass it over to Ben. Thanks, I hate it. Mm. Me too. <laughs> hate how much I love it. I will untap. Notice how I didn't attack because I'm a nice I friend. I will get a clue token because I investigated at my upkeep. Mm. Woohoo. And I will draw a card. <laughs> hey guys, it's Blue's Ooh. Clues. <laughs> huh. But it, Just me guys? All right, cool. Whatever. <laughs> you guys thought that was funny. Yeah. I will tap two to play the Arcane Signet. <laughs> and then I will tap three to play Fabricate. I will search my library for an artifact card, reveal it, and put it in my hand, and then shuffle. Everybody on that tutor train. Yeah. Tutors are for nerds. That's an enchantment. Damn it. Didn't she both have the whispering thing? What's that? <laughs> <laughs> I, I, <laughs> I think it's an introvert thing, you know? Yeah. I, I Stop attacking me with your stupid soul fire. <laughs> It might be the soul ring that you have. Like, your shrines are really annoying. I don't have many ways to remove them. I just Good. Want, yeah, I'm really unhappy about it. I can't hear you over the sound of your whispering. I can't hear me over the sound of my own whispering. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's the soul ring. You're grabbing soul ring with fabricate? I think so, yeah. I don't no, get the sun. Oh, you have it. What? You already have the Sun's Core, don't you? No, I don't. It's a Cage Sun? Cage Sun. It's in the deck. The sun's Core. Hand, That's a good name for it. That's a good, good name for a card, too. Why aren't you naming cards, bro? I could die. Everybody's got a calling. Yeah, I, I have to, guys. I have to. <laughs> I have to. <laughs> Get ready I for the comments. Hey, I'll roast you. This I is know, rough. Man. I'll roast you. <laughs> I can't even play it this turn. I know. Either. I know. <laughs> so, so, Ben. One more time. What did you fetch with that fabricate? I fetched a soul ring. <laughs> and are you going to cast your soul ring? I am not, uh... because I cannot this turn. But I will pass. <laughs> oh, pass. <laughs> okay. What's funny is if he knew he was going to fetch the soul ring, he could have sequenced yeah. and had it cast it and use it to play the arcane signet. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. Sequencing. Oh it is important. Did I mention Shay? You're looking very nice today, and <laughs> he doesn't want to be attacked now. Not anymore. Weird. That's sus. Hmm. Hmm. I like your shirt. Don't attack me. <laughs> Tibble, that you. Lattery will not save you, Blake. <laughs> oh. Save me before. We're gonna keep going until it does. <laughs> uh, all right, we're gonna play an isolated chapel. It does not enter tapped because I control a swamp. And I am overwhelmed by the options. Okay, there is one thing I know I want to do. Tapping one here for the Orzov Signet, as well as Sacred Foundry, which will give me three total. Um, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. For Ishin, two heavens as one. It's a lot of heavens. It's a lot of heavens. I don't think I can play instance. <clears throat> and I think I'm gonna hang out for now. Entering my attack step. Who oh mmm. Mm. Mm. Uh, 
Yeah, let's see who you attack. Feel pity on me. <laughs> I'm at the lowest life. I won't block if you attack me, so I won't feel bad. The, mm. CGB is at a, a mighty fine 45 right now. I also have a pretty it's nasty a really thing rough coming locker. together. Yeah, that's yeah, true. Yeah. And a lot of mana untapped. And, yeah, and mana. Geez. Suspicious amounts uh, of mana yeah, untapped. Yeah. Sauce. Yeah. Scary. Indeed. Mm. So, I'm thinking I'm going to first swing with Ryu. And that's going to go to Blake. It's attacking alone. So that's 3-3 three, three first strike. Yep, and you will trigger your... Sure will. Thank you. It's too bad you can't use the channel ability, but it's not in your hand. Yeah. Because it would be cheap because she has all these legendaries. Oh, it would yeah. only cost one mana, but oh, it's yeah. not in her hand. So that I, would be cool. I will take it. Okay. Second. You, like, touch your oh, wait. Just, like, double, just this is double trigger. Sure. Her commander's in play. Mm, yes. So she's going to have An two extra. more combats. Yep. And she and gets two combat. cards. Yeah, so you get to, to flip another one here. March of Reckless Joy. Which can flip more cards if you decide <laughs> to use it. Yeah. You definitely don't have to use it right now. In fact, you can't right now because okay. of Teferi. Right. So you can wait till your next main phase. Yep. So. so you have another two combats. Okay. Another two combats. Yep, we're attacking uh, what? Blake again. <laughs> After I complimented your shirt, <laughs> I will I take you. three. The flattery will not save you. Yes, attacking you with Ryu. Okay, uh, but triggers. Triggers. So yes. Boom boom. Exiling again. What are you? Rizona, Asari Commander has haste. Combat damage to a player if it doesn't have an indestructible counter on it. Put an indestructible counter. On it. <laughs> I thought for sure she, she said Asari Commander. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. No, it's so a very sorry, sorry Commander. <laughs> oh, so sorry. Oh, um, I just come in also, from down upstate. Um, double trigger so because of your yep, commander. You too. Oh my goodness. You're going to have a lot of choices. Yeah, lots of triggers. Okay, Brutal Horde Chief attacks. Defending player loses one life and you gain a life. Uh, that's going to be one you wish you had the mana for. Yeah. Maybe you can hit a soul ring. You get one more attack. Right. Okay. Perfect. Last combat. Last combat. Um, this time... Mm, I don't think I want to swing out with both on the... Last time. Why wouldn't you? Ben takes all the damage. Hey, don't worry about it. Yeah, right, I'm not well, worried about well, it, actually. Well, I, I am. am. I am. Yeah, me too. <laughs> Shay, you're doing great. <laughs> yeah. All right, I'm going to send Ryu to Blake and Alicia to, mm. to Ben. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> two. yeah, yeah, yeah. That was, was, the, two. That was Three. The. So they do tap this time, and I have... They, they didn't attack alone, they so they don't They did not attack alone, that. you're yeah. correct. Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. So that will end my combat. And then I think I would like to cast Rusona. Sorry, Commander. So I'm going to tap three. Every time. I can't, yeah. can't unhear I hear how sorry <laughs> this Commander is. Oh, I'm yes, sorry I'm attacking so alone. Very, very polite. Very polite. Okay. And then these are going to go to exile. All right. Um, so this spell is on the stack. It is on the stack. All right, I'm gonna make, I, I don't have anything against you, I just kind of need to use my mana on something. So, <laughs> mm. yeah, yeah, th that's what they all say. I know, yeah, I know. Not a very good excuse thing. But being mana efficient. I'm gonna cast Brutal Expulsion oh. for two mana, because it has two targets. It returns target spell or creature to its owner's hand, and deals two damage to target creature or planeswalker. If that permanent would be put into a graveyard this turn, exile it instead. I'm doing two damage to the Herald of the Pantheon, oh. and exiling it. And I'm returning this spell on the stack to your hand. Just, okay. So, just a little stall tactic. I miss my friend Harold. It has haste, so you can play yeah, it next time and attack anyway. Right. <laughs> but I wanted Harold to go away. Yeah. Okay, dude. Okay, I'm passing the turn. All right. I'll draw. So, as promised, Teferi's just going to bounce a mana rock somewhere and go away. Uh, but I'll do that in just a minute. I might want to attack someone. <laughs> like like, like Blake and the, all these shrines I can't target. I'm going to attack Blake for 2-2, two, two, I think. Yep. Mm. 
Ah, but it only says cast spells. Oh, you have, you have a trick? What are you... I have an oh, you're gonna, trick. You're gonna, you're gonna sanctum it? Oh. It depends. Are we gonna be, me- are we gonna be enemies on this? I, I, don't, I don't think we have to fight too much. I just want some life. And I already attacked him like four times. Besides, I, I, I said I'm gonna get rid of this Teferi. I plan to. That's fine. I will take two. Yeah. All right. Thanks. Considering you're probably gonna bounce Orzhov Signet here, right? Uh, I'd hope so. Yeah, in a minute. Um, (laughs) (laughs) Is there anything else I want to do before I lose my great Teferi's protection? Uh, All right, yep, we're gonna bounce Orzhov Signet and I'll draw a card. It it, it did its job. It fought fought the fight with the Lotus Bloom. It's it's a good job. And then I use two mana to cast Azorius Signet. Then I'm going to go for four mana, casting Whirlwind of Thought. And this says whenever I cast a non-creature spell, I draw a card. It's an enchantment. It's like a shrine, but good. <laughs> oh, I mean, oh. comment, get him. <laughs> get this man. Then if that resolves, I'm done. The end of your turn. Peace in our time. <laughs> Now there can never be peace, and <laughs> there is no peace. I'm gonna pay two mana and one life off Battlefield Forge to Path to Exile, Ishin Two Heavens is one. So this exiles it, it huh. you may go get a land from your deck and put it on Battlefield Tap, because I'm a nice guy. Basically. I'm a nice guy, <laughs> basically, <laughs> indeed. That face. <laughs> so yeah, go ahead and uh, get a basic, because I'm just such a good friend. Mm, okay, and uh, he's just exile. a basic person. Okay. <laughs> Damn, Ben, it's messed up. <laughs> okay, basic land card? Yep. Okay. <clears throat> I'm ramping you, Shay. I'm giving you the mana that he bounced back to your mm-hmm. hand. Mm-hmm. <laughs> she doesn't sound too impressed. I, think. <laughs> I don't think I can trigger. <laughs> yeah, there you go. <laughs> She's too smart for me. I'm really amazed I'm still not being targeted. Hey, yeah. you would be. If you also I was can't really able deal with my stuff like, too well. Stuff. I can't deal with your shrine. Shay can well. deal with this pretty well, and I don't like that. 25 life, Shay could just kill you. Yeah. She wouldn't know. She's my, my pal. Okay, well, in any case, I'm going to untap. <laughs> Small hand probs. That, that's what you're really annoyed with. Like, yeah. The commander, whatever. Yeah. Make me shuffle. <laughs> Making me shuffle in Terrible. 2022. These are fresh <laughs> sleeves, you <laughs> bastard. <laughs> Moving my second main phase, I'm going to draw two off Sanctum of Calm Wa- Waters. Whoppers? <laughs> Sanctum of Calm Waters? <laughs> Well, rewind for the comments. I gained two life from Brutal Expulsion hitting your um, thingy because it spells have lifelink. Indeed. Yep. Rewind for the people in the comments. Anyone have any extra lands I could borrow? No? Okay. No, I don't. Cool. <laughs> I missed two already. They've got some draft packs of lands here at the store, I'm sure. You know? True. <laughs> I'm going to pay two life of all these painful lands I have, and I'm going to play... My Sanctum of All. Once again, this lets me go get a shrine out of my deck and put it on the battlefield every upkeep of mine. And uh, if I have six or more shrines, they trigger twice. To me, shrines. To me, Hester. I will untap. Oh, and discard off Sanctum of Calm Waters before everyone loses it. I will make another clue. Hooray. And I will draw. Hooray. All right. Island. That's a land. Heck yeah. He's ramping. Well, we know Late, there's... but still ramping. Oh, we know what he can do. We'll tap one. Oh, play a soul ring. Resolves. <laughs> oh, look at that. Everyone's tapped out. Amazing. Back. I see that smirk. Be reasonable. CGB. Don't do it. Mm. Don't do it. <laughs> I'm going to tap three. Play a Shimmer Mirror. Flash, you may cast artifact spells as though they had flash. And I will play a Planeswalker, Kazmina, and, 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 and Enigma. Enigma. No, 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 you've got Mentor. it. There it is. There we go. I have a degree. What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> In words. Uh, spells your opponent's cast that target a creature or Planeswalker you control costs two more to cast. And Minus two is create a two-two blue wizard creature token. Draw a card, then discard it. Yes, I will minus two down to 
three. I will make a blue wizard creature token. Indeed. <laughs> Indeed. <laughs> little guy right there. What's up, dude? What's up, little guy? I will draw a card. Ooh, that's a nice one, though. <laughs> Ooh. <sighs> Gotta do it, though. I'm gonna discard God Pharaoh's statue. Good! Good! Yeah. You just put that in the graveyard. That's yeah. fine. You're welcome, guys. Well, that's also scary. What does it mean that's in his hand, dude? <laughs> I don't know if I want to know. I don't... <laughs> ben must die. <laughs> we must break. I He's will starting pass. to do things. I miss my. I miss Harold. Okay, first I'm gonna play a swamp. I don't. And then I will plot my revenge. Ooh. On who, though? Yeah, indeed. I haven't done anything to you. Neither have I. Uh, <laughs> you you <laughs> exiled your commander. All right, let's do this. Yeah. Revenge me, dude. Yeah. You did Ramper, though. I I was there. <laughs> Tapping three for Rasona. A sorry commander. <laughs> indeed. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> he keeps apologizing. <laughs> I'm real sick of this guy. So polite. Uh, then I'm gonna hang out again. I'm gonna swing Ryu, entering my combat phase, of course. Um, swinging Ryu at Blake. No blocks. No blocks. Because you triggers. Triggers. Just one. Okay, I'm actually getting kind of murdered this game. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's gonna make things hard to block. Mm hmm. But you have yeah. another combat phase before you can wor worry about playing that one. Yes. And sure now you have three creatures that can attack. I sure do. I don't know if you heard, but I really like your shirt, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> then I'm going to swing Ryu and one day. Rasona. They smell fear. Ben. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh. Three, three, first strike and a three, three. 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 Haste. Okay. Hmm. I will, I'll just block that one. Okay. Well, you're, they both die because your 2-2 two -two is a 3-2 because you have Heraldic Band. Oh, that is oh. true, yes. Oh, okay. Thank you. Fair enough. Yeah, 3-2. Blocking. Okay. Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, you're so sorry. <laughs> sorry, It's Captain. a very sorry commander. <laughs> okay, so then um, a sorry commander will die. And you'll take three? I will take three, yes. Not exiled. Okay, and then um, coming off of combat, I'm going to pay three to cast Imperial Subduer. What does she do? Oh yeah, so Imperial Subduer. Whenever a samurai or warrior you control attacks alone, tap target creature you don't control. Ooh, okay. Makes it hard to block for all of us because we yeah. never have creatures on the board. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I'm not a creature guy. <laughs> Untap, draw. <laughs> Blake! Don't look at me, dude. <laughs> yeah, no. Come on, I'm at I, money, I just want bro. my two life, man. I just <laughs> want my two oh, life. You can take you know two what? life. You know what? I don't need my two life if uh, you're not going to sanctum this anytime soon. You know? Oh, I promise I won't sanctum it. Oh, wow. Interesting. In that case, I will attack Kazmina with Hinata the Dawncrowned. Attempt to kill that. Not like that. Hmm. Dude, I don't like taxes. Yeah. My account reminds I mean, me who... every day tax season is coming, and I don't like it. <laughs> okay. Oh. You don't have to pay your taxes today, CGB. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> then I'm done. Dude. No, I'm done. She tapped those lands. No, I'm good. Brain. I'm really good <laughs> right, right now. I'm, I'm so my... good. Well, then, I don't know if I, I might try Sanctum you. Uh, I'm going to trigger Sanctum of all. Let's go get some friends. There it is. It's a bottom card. Or Again, the last one right? Look at. For real. <laughs> This week we decided to try out 250 card decks. If you're wondering <laughs> yeah. why searching the oh deck might take a minute. <laughs> Wait, it's not in here. <laughs> Actually not in your deck? It should be. It's somewhere. <laughs> well, that There's like four options play. I want to We've play, extended so. tutoring to binders as yeah. well. <laughs> That's amazing. It's like the best shrine, too. Well, it's gone now. 
Um, That's all right. Do we need to go get it? No. Oh, it's right here. Go. <laughs> we did it. I'm going to grab Sanctum of Fruitful Harvest. At the beginning of your pre-combat main phase, add X mana, where X is the number of shrines I control. Ooh. Which is like one or two or four. <laughs> Perfect. I will go to my pre-combat main phase. I will trigger, trigger. I'm going to draw four cards with Sanctum of Calm Waters. This is fine. Yeah, no, no big deal. That's what I'm saying. Just, yeah. And I will discard a Mesa Enchantress. Goodbye. The pretty secret layer one. I'm starting to think Half Dead is a, is about half too, sh too few. Like we, right. we need to do about 20 more quickly. I will now mm. make four mana, blue mana, in my main phase. Play Training Center untapped. Seven mana, and I'm gonna overload a Cyclonic Rift. Really? Mm. Really? All right. I have no response. Oh, I know you don't. <laughs> I, have re I have a response. Sweet. I, I have a response. You mind? There's some scary stuff out here, man. You're it's not the only one with scary fine. stuff. It's just saying, fine. it might be beneficial to let it resolve. Yeah, I would love to just have nothing on the board and have you have all those shrines. <laughs> I think you want the same thing. I think you want the same thing here. <laughs> How much mana do you have open? Three. You have three mana open. Potentially some blue mana too. I have. Oh. Okay. Man, I, I just have this, everybody's going to do something insane for the next turn cycle, and you're first in the turn order, and I have no idea how bad it's going to get, and this is kind of intense. Um, so, I control my commander, I cast Fierce Guardianship for zero, I trigger Whirlwind of Thought, trigger on the stack to draw a card. Nice. Yeah, dude. We s not this time. Praise the almighty CGB. <laughs> Defender of the table. Yes. The feature of the shrines. <laughs> I could have paid and gotten back Fierce Guardianship, but I have a feeling I'm going to need my mana. Hmm. I'm going to move to my end step. Uh, I have no effects. Pass the turn. I will untap. I will get a third clue token at my upkeep. Now you can tap the journal, sacrifice those three, and search for any card. Yes, I can. Thank you. Yeah. I will draw. I think you might live to regret that fierce guardianship. Do you think he knows how Flash works yet? <laughs> he he could it. search for like any artifact and play it at flash <laughs> speed, and he could do both those things at instant speed. If and I he don't have to reveal to. it either. I love how he loves that part of the card. <laughs> that's a, yeah, that's the best it's part. a secret. It's a, it's a secret. <laughs> you, know, safe, you, you don't know, know what I know. got. <laughs> He's going to be like, well, you don't know what I got, but Cyclonic Rift. <laughs> I'll tap seven and attempt to cast Jingataxius Progress Tyrant. Did you have to? And you're not even doing it at flash speed. It's not an artifact. Oh, it's not an artifact. Yeah, no, oh, I thought not. it was. Phyrexians, yeah. I just always think they're artifacts. Yeah. It's in my head. Um, I have a response. Shay, any response? I do not have a response. Okay. I'm going to... Pray at one of my shrines? No. <laughs> Four mana. Activate Soulfire Grandmaster. The next time I cast an instant or sorcery spell from my hand this turn, put the card back into my hand instead of the graveyard as it resolves. I actually have to tap differently. So I'm going to pay for it. This is going to make two white, or no. It has to be blue, blue. Okay, this is going to make two blue. This is how I'm paying for the Grandmaster ability. Then I'm going to figure out how I'm doing it, but I'm going to cast this Magma Opus for two mana. So, because <laughs> I, I need to have enough targets. So if I have to have six targets total, then I need to go one damage to... Did you read it first? So, Magma Opus deals four damage divided as you choose among any number of targets. Tap two target permanents. Create a 4-4 four, four blue and red elemental creature token. Draw two cards. I, uh, and this spell will have lifelink. Um, and it's going to come back to my hand as it resolves. 
It's gonna trigger Whirlwind of Thought, but I have to find six targets because it's reduced by one for each target. That's how right. I'm paying it for two mana. Right. So I have to target six different things. So I'd love to kill like your Shimmer Mirror or something like that, but if I target it twice, I can't cast this. So I'm going to deal one damage to each of you, and I'm going to deal one damage to this because it annoys me. Okay. And I'm going to tap two permanents. So I'm going to target the island that you have untapped, Ben. And I'm going to target your Shimmer Mirror. And, oh wait, okay, then I have to deal the one damage to something else. I'll, I'll deal it to Ryu, because I need six different mm -hmm. targets. Um, I also can't target things for zero, which is something that a lot of people get confused. You have to target it for at least one damage. Um, I get that a lot. So yeah, this gets tapped, your island gets tapped. One damage to each of you, and Ryuji here. I gain four. I draw from Whirlwind of Thought. I draw two cards from Magma Opus, and Magma Opus returns to my hand. And I get a 4-4 Elemental. And then I have to consult my hand and decide if uh, there's anything I can do about this Jingataxius <laughs> thing. And it resolves. Uh, well, I'm passing. I'm passing to Please Blake. Who, Blake's totally gonna stop it, right? It doesn't say that we're an enchantment. It's my friend. Get what? out. Get in here, Jin. <laughs> yeah. That's a real. Uh, yeah. Okay, that's spooky. <laughs> hurts you guys way more than it hurts me. I will pass. Okay. I'm gonna warn you now, Shay. If you attack me, I will destroy your entire board. <laughs> Ooh, whoa. So leave me alone for a turn. <laughs> wow. You have one turn to leave me alone. Hmm. Well, <laughs> I know who that leaves. <laughs> she, I don't think she likes her, her cards getting countered, man. She mostly has creatures and enchantments, I'm assuming. You, you think this only affects me? Mostly. Mostly. <laughs> mostly. Yes. You might be right about that. <laughs> Maybe a little to Blake with his instance, but he's he's We're not friends. worrying about it. So. You know what? I could be worried more, you know? Yeah, there you go. He's my boy. You don't have enough shrines up. He's, so, uh, he's got so, so many. He's got, he got legs up to you're, here, You're going to worry when he starts getting basically doubling season. Oh, I'm also not worried about it once I've untapped, too. I got lots of plans. Oh, okay. My deck's about to yeah. stay stagnant on its power level. Uh-huh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, sure about that. <laughs> not, People usually don't brag about that. You weren't going to say pop off? I would never say pop you, off. Okay. It's not even in my vocabulary. I, if you live, Shay, Shay's got that look. Keep in mind, Shay. I can get around your tax, Jenga taxes, and destroy your board. So just let's be friends. Mm, okay. Considered. Thank you. Uh, first, we're gonna play Arid Mesa. I am gonna tap it, pay a life, and sacrifice to search my library for a mountain or plains card. All right. So I grabbed a plains. All right, tap in five, four, ankle shanker. Ankle shanker. All right. <laughs> um, poor so, ankles. Yeah. Ankle shanker has haste, <laughs> and whenever he attacks, creatures you control gain first strike and death touch until end of turn. So when you attack with your commander out, they gain first strike and death touch twice? Oh, <laughs> oh man. Square. And that doesn't Square. turn into double strike, unfortunately. Yeah, unfortunately. So that's fun. That is fun. Double death touch should do something like right? that. Right? It gets infect. <laughs> yeah. Right. I'm really curious whose ankles are getting shit. <laughs> right. I'm serious. You're serious? Like how serious? I'm super serious. If you attack me, I will destroy you. <laughs> You're bored. You have three mana over there. Uh, it's Sanctum of Shattered oh, Heights. He right. can just discard cards to kill creatures. Gets around Jenga Taxes. Yeah. I got three mana and a lot of shrines. It's a big problem. So leave me alone. That is a big problem. Friend. Need four shrines. So CGB, you have a 2-2, two, two, white yep. link, and a 4-4 four, four token over yep. there. Yep, that's what I got. I will attack CGB with Ryu. 
And so when that happens, whenever a samurai or warrior you control attacks alone, tap target creature you don't control. Uh-huh. So I think I'd like to tap your token. Okay. So Ryu's coming in for three, and that will also trigger this. Fireflux squad. I only got three mana. <laughs> yep, so I guess we're not playing that one. Yeah, nope. No blocks on the Ryu. I go to 50. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Darn. <laughs> Um, Guys are jealous. I can hear it in your voice. <laughs> I can hear jelly just oozing off you. It's not attractive. True. Just yeah. Damn. Uh, second combat. Second combat. Yep. I'm going to swing with all at CGB. Oh my. All right. Um, are you using Alesha who smiles at death? Um, I don't have a target for that, so no. Okay. Ankle shanker means they all have first strike and death touch. Correct. Okay. This will trigger... It won't because you attacked with multiple things. Correct. Okay. So I will take 11, I guess. 11 damage. Oh, no. Oh, oh, starting man. life. Oh, jeez. Oh, <laughs> uh, 39. Feeling fine. Feeling fine. <laughs> Your hero here still has a lot of a lot of winning to do. Yeah, you got to figure out how the heck to deal with all this. And then I'm going to pay three in my second main phase for Lelia, the Blade Reforged. So. She has haste, and whenever she attacks, exile the top card of your library. You may play that card this turn. Whenever a spell or ability you control exiles one or more card from your library and or your graveyard, put a 1-1 one, one counter. I'm guessing you play it post-combat just in case you hit something better off uh, Tempered in Solitude. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yep. Gotcha. Then I will pass the turn. Untap. Draw. The same deal I made with Shragos for you, too. It was a deal. I thought it sounded more like a threat to me. Like, true. <laughs> hmm. Is that so? Indeed. It's For all friends here. Uh huh. Best friends. <laughs> hey, CGB, can you get rid of like two shrines by chance? Okay, chill. Ch -ch -ch what do you mean? I mean, you're the one who can tutor yeah. your deck and copy anything you get. I mean, I don't know if Mono Blue's going to deal with the shrines very well, but... That's why I'm asking. Uh, then why are you asking? <laughs> you need me to do it. Very cool, dude. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Get him. <laughs> Untapped Glacial Fortress. Your own commander, by the way, is what's stopping me. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, from killing some shrines? Oh. Yeah. Oh, okay. Fair, so, fair really enough. nice of you to ask. Would you mind just exiling <laughs> it for a minute for me? Yeah, okay, that's what I thought. Yeah, fair enough. Thank you, man. <laughs> You're bro. Well, I can't block the Shea army, so I may as well attack something. And Ben's stuff is insane, and you have the Sanctum of Shattered Heights, so I guess I have to attack Ben in the air with a 4-4 Dawn Crowned. Hinata! Peace in my time. Okay, mm. yeah, I will take four. Dropping you to 20. C, yes. I'll move down step, I'll discard Prismatic Vista. Your turn. All right. I will. Um, oh, I'm also going to. I'm sorry. I'm also going to discard Fable Passage. Your turn. I will untap. On my upkeep, I will trigger Sanctum of All. Is that cool? It's so cool, dude. Thanks, man. <laughs> so awesome. I look forward to it. Insanely cool. Thank you. There's a lot of spooky creatures out. So I'm going to get Goshintai of Hidden Cruelty. This is a 2 2 Death Touch Shrine. At the beginning of your end step, you may pay one. When you do destroy target creature with toughness X or less, where X is the number of shrines I control. Cool. I don't yeah. like that. I don't either. <laughs> Does it help if I like it? No. no. That's cool. worse than that. Right. Right. 
whatever, dude. In my first main, well, I will draw for turn. And then in my first main phase, I will make five green mana. And I will draw, sure, I'll draw five cards. No problem. <laughs> if I have to, dude. You don't have to. Shrines. Mm. Frickin' shrines. I will play a Dragon Skull Summit untapped. You know, the weird thing is he talks about decimating the board. We should just make him do it. He'd have to discard shrines to do it. Or lands. <laughs> Drawn a lot of cards. Mm. I'm going to start by paying all five of my green mana for privileged, po privileged position. Other permanents you control can't be the target of spells or abilities your opponents control. Got a little... Other uh, permanents? Other permanents I control. Hmm. Any responses, Ben? I have no response. Cool. No response. Super cool. <laughs> You're freaking commander, Ben. Be cool. Be cool. Uh. <laughs> Do you have a Cyclonic Rift? In the graveyard. No, no, no. Ben, do you have a Cyclonic Rift? <laughs> In my deck, yes. Okay, and you can go get it. I can, yes. That okay. is true. I'm yeah. just I do not have the mana right just now. Just speaking out loud. Okay, right, fair enough. Yes. But, okay, that, I mean, mm. I I don't know what else to do other than right. like yeah, throw enough. stuff around and dig and try to find an answer, right. which sure. probably won't work, and I'll probably lose two spells doing it because of Jenga taxes. Right. It's sure. bad, so okay. I guess that resolves. Sweet. I'm just making sure that there's something that can yes, yeah, fix it. Them all, yeah. all right, I am going to pay two mana to cast Go Shintai of Lost Wisdom. This is an 0-4 flyer. At the beginning of your end step, I may pay one. If I do, target player mills X cards, where X is the number of shrines I control. This now trigger or turns on Sanctum of All. So now, anytime a shrine would trigger, I can have it trigger twice. <laughs> Boo. Yeah, boo. Boo. <laughs> Your boos sustain me. Uh huh. Perfect. Uh huh. I will then move to my end step. Here we go now. Where I'm going to trigger some stuff. So I will pay one with Sanctum of Shattered Heights, discard a flooded strand, and I will deal six damage to your commander. No! Indeed. No! Indeed. I have no response. And I get a, another trigger on it, so... The other one actually has to target, so I will target your... <laughs> She's like, no, not me. I'll target your f extra combat phase. Mm -hmm. you. Um, hmm. I'm trying to think of a something. I'm trying to think of something. Don't don't give up yet. Oh, okay. <laughs> cool. <laughs> cool. <laughs> I'll cast March of Swirling Mist for. I'm, I'm just going to target every creature, but it's getting countered by Jenga Taxes. That ability only triggers once each turn, so now I get to do more stuff. That is a bummer. <laughs> I'm going to cast Magma Opus. Do I want to pay? Oh, it is a bummer. Thank you, Ben. <laughs> wow. I know how good that card is. <laughs> You're feeling for me now? I is am you... a little bit, yes. <laughs> this is your commander causing the trouble. <laughs> ben, He's oh my god. He's an evil dude, man. He's a traitor. He's, you know, he's out uh, for some phyrexia. Ben, you... He's also got long legs. All right. Okay. Can't trust to do with long legs. You can't target oh, your things. Sorry. Um... Can't target your thing. I really think Ben's gonna Cyclonic Rift just because there's nothing else you can really do. Um, and I need to name targets for this anyway. I'm gonna be able to cast some instant in response, but I lost my best one to save this, which is the March. So I'm trying to decide how much mana I have to use or if I should pay for yeah, the soul fire. How is that getting saved? What? How is your dude getting saved right now? Which one? Your commander. Uh, not yet. Oh, I'm okay. trying to figure out a way. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I got you. I was like, <laughs> I'm trying to find no, yeah, the good. way. All right. Um, so, if I have two targets, I guess I'm going to. I can't target your permanence at all. I okay. can target just this one. 
that I can target the privileged position. <laughs> right. And it would be a privilege to do so. Well, I guess I'll tap Jingitaxis and privileged position. I'm trying to think of what I can draw into. I think I can pay two more, but I think if I pay three more, it's not going to work. No? Oh, wait, okay. There, I think there is something I can draw. All right, I'm gonna pay two more. I'm gonna deal one damage to Ben and three damage to Blake. Sure. To the face, because you deserve it. <laughs> In privileged position, we'll get tapped. So we'll then get it's rough. Yes. Trigger Whirlwind of Thought. Mm -hmm. Oh, that triggers on the Swirling Mist too. Yep. Okay. And you don't even gain life for the damage. Uh, uh, yeah, in, in a moment, okay. hopefully. All right, two Whirlwind of Thought triggers. Damage, four life. Two cards, another elemental, this is gone, and uh, this is going to die, so that's very sad. So then so will yours. Oh, yep. right. Sorry. Couldn't, couldn't save it, Shay. I appreciate the effort. I didn't have, I didn't have what it took. Perfect. Then I will pass. Uh, then it goes to your turn. I will discard. You deciding not to do the mill trigger? No. no. Okay. Discard Crumbling Necropolis. I will untap. I will trigger Tamiyo's Journal and get a, another clue. I mean, I don't know how powerful what Ben is going to do is, but I'm pretty sure none of us will get another real chance if there's another turn here. Um, yup. Arch enemy number one, baby. Haters gonna hate. So it's gonna be sad, but I'm last in the turn order. I think you gotta force him to use the Shattered Heights by throwing creatures at it. I, that's... What? What do you mean? My, my take on the situation is you have to attack him and force him to use his Sanctum of Shattered Heights so that one of us can eventually hit him. Got some blue mana open there, Blaine. No, oh, I do. I have two, two blue mana. Two, three. three. I will sacrifice three clues <laughs> to search my deck for a card. What do you think, with his commander in play, with what appears to be the rest of us out of like stuff we can really do about it, what do you think is the worst possible yeah. thing <laughs> he can find to do with that commander? As a matter of fact, I will respond to that. The trigger? Yeah. Oh, yeah? What are you? I'm going to pay one for Sanctum of Shattered Heights. I'm going to discard a land. I'm going to do six to that creature, your commander, and six damage to my ankles. Um, but the, the ankle shaker! There's no, there's no way. I don't really want First Strike Death Touch when I have an 04 that I can block with. Uh, that is a I don't feel good about ability, it. right? Yeah. Right. 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 yeah. Mine's an activated ability. Yeah, right. Oh, yeah. My goes the command. Mm -hmm. You can catch your spells, dude. I'm a nice guy. I bet. Remember Nothing me? sus about this. Nothing. Nothing sus about this. Indeed. It's not every day, I feel like. It's like these two are just living a pretty crazy life over here. Feels doing good. whatever the hell they want. And uh, you're welcome I'm, to come I'm just to my trying not to die. Even though I have 43 life, I feel like it's going to get nasty. Look at how pretty my shrines are. You guys can come visit. There's a tourist fee, but you can come check them out. Look at that face. So smug. Ah, <laughs> so smug. So much smug. I, I don't want to look at your hand, but I'm literally sure yeah. I'm getting. <laughs> anywhere left in my right, right shoulder without seeing it, if you put it there. <laughs> you can know, I'm not afraid. But they'll, they'll, they, no, they, they no, yell no, at me no, for I'm cheating. Strong. You yell at me for cheating. <laughs> Guys, I, how can I not? <laughs> you want to give them the hand. We'll tap. One, two. Three. Step six, and I will Rivers Rebuke Blake. Target 
player returns all non-land permanents to their to the owner's hand? Yes. Blake, you've been rivers rebuked. How do you how do you respond? I will remand it. Does that just count as it? Yeah, it returns it to your hand though, and I draw a card. How much mana do you have left? I will pack the negation that. Oh my. Pact of negation, <laughs> targeting remand. Yeah. River's rebuke. Possibly live again. A counter war I'm not involved in. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. This is such riveting content. <laughs> he resolves. Okay. Put that there. Whoa. Whoa. You're welcome. <laughs> Whoa. I'm, I'm going to start a shrine to Ben. <laughs> <laughs> Probably um, cost no mana, doesn't do anything. Try to light a candle shrine anyway. every day at my Ben shrine. And <laughs> it's a... Yeah. I, the fun well, place has come, everybody. I'll, I'll swing to it, Blake. <laughs> Just to put more <laughs> icing on the cake. No, you, no, I mean, you made an enemy. Holy Why crap. hold back? Why hold I will, back I will pass now. <laughs> <laughs> this is interesting because Shay still got a lot of power, and so do I. All right. Yeah. <laughs> this is an You're interesting like dealing spot with these now. dudes, bro. Mm -hmm. hmm. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. <laughs> God, what now? <laughs> Anybody else get reminded when she does that? Of like the Velociraptors, <laughs> you know, when they're about to attack. Clever girl. They're, they're like planning the, the, yeah. the sounds they use to communicate. <laughs> She's talking to all her raptor friends from the other deck. <laughs> Tapping three for Mardu Ascendancy. Whenever a non-token creature you control attacks, put a 1-1 red goblin creature token onto the battlefield tapped and attacking. I can also sacrifice it, and creatures I control get plus O, plus three until end of turn. Then, I shall cast one. I'm gonna tap five for Goldspan Dragon. Okay. That's a card. That is a card. That's, That's a, a card. card. No responses. Mm-hmm. And then I shall swing all at Blake. Ooh. All right, so uh, trigger Goldspan Dragon for a treasure. No mana to use there. You do get, this only triggers when you attack alone. Right. What does this do? Um, so whenever it attacks, exile the top card of my library, I may play it. So I do have to exile, but I will not be able to play. She gets buffed when you do that. Anguish on making. Correct. Okay. Thank you. And you attack with four creatures. Is that four one one attacking one, two, goblins three, as well? Four. Yes. I have two goblins, and I will put the counters on though to signify four total. So when you create them, you just can you decide who they attack, or do they attack the same player? Um, you get to question. decide. Okay, so you want to, you're attacking him for 14. So 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So one should attack him, but the other three can attack someone else if you wish. Mm -hmm. I'd recommend not me because I'll block with lifelinks and other things. Right. So I'll have three goblins there. And yes, yeah, so that one will go to Blake, and I'll send three over right. to Ben. And like that, my board is gone. It the was shrines. all there, and then it was all gone. The yeah, that was a quick turn on me. The shrines get from decided. the table. Yeah, it feels bad, man. Yeah. I mean, rivers are buking to murder. Shrines are <laughs> shrines are all nice and friendly till they're not. You're right, exactly. True. Yeah, it's true. Yeah, like they're just was... drawing me cards, guys. No, no big deal. That's fine. That was scary. Just added mana. And yeah, don't worry six, about it. Those eight lands I had out were terrifying. Yeah. I will pass the turn. Okay. Untap. Draw. Right, now I want CGB to win. Let's go. Uh, it's a pretty weird situation, yeah. because I could definitely put a lot of damage on Ben, because he's wide open and a low <laughs> life total, but then Shay's gonna just 
destroy me. So I need to find some way through this. Sea of Clouds, untap blue white land. Gold Span Dragon. Yes. Yeah, Gold Span Dragon. Mm. That's a rough one. <laughs> that's a lot of power. Is that the alchemy version or the regular? <laughs> Production got it, so <laughs> if that that's all that matters at the end of the day. <laughs> They're the only people at the table I like. <laughs> and they're not even at the table. I know. <laughs> oh yeah, that's true. I'm going to cast Prismatic Ending, and this is going to I'm gonna put in three different colors. This has Converge. Exile target non-land permanent if its mana value is less than or equal to the number of colors spent to cast this spell. So, I'm spending three colored mana, and I'm tired of getting Mardu Ascendancy, and I'm triggering Whirlwind of Thought to draw a card. I could use the Grandmaster to get it back, but I think I'll need my mana for other things. Okay. It exiles it? Yep, exiles okay. it. It's a little too strong. Interesting. Um, very terrifying what that card can do. Yeah. I'm going to cast Sunscorch Regent. Mm -hmm. This is a 4-3 Flying Dragon. Whenever an opponent casts a spell, put a plus one, plus one counter on Sunscorch Regent and I gain one life. Hmm. I'm going to attack Ben with my Soulfire Grandmaster for two because I want two life. This Soulfire Grandmaster is walking through a yeah. sea if, of darkness I, just like please don't Dude, die. somehow it's been on the board I don't even since understand. turn two this yeah, entire that, yeah, game. That is pretty crazy. It's gained you like and, 12 Which months. means we have not wiped the board. I don't know what's become of oh, our playroom. Oh, my board group. got wiped, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if you guys were there for that. <laughs> I remember. Okay, yeah, I did too. Right. Never uh, forget. Discard to hand size my Sacred Foundry. Your turn, Ben. Okay. Right. I will untap. I will get a clue token. I will just use a dice. Whatever. Two clues. And I will pay one, two... Three, four, five, four packed, and then draw. I definitely feel a little better leaving him alive, knowing he can't do much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fair enough. Yeah. 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 I have no idea how bloodthirsty Shay's going to be on her turn. Yeah, I'm kidding. Maybe a little. Maybe a little. Potentially. Then yeah. watch out. She's out for blood. CGB, what would you say is, I would probably guess a gold span, but the one to attack next turn, what is the most scary? I mean, gold span and the amount of mana it can make is incredible. Right. Yeah. It's probably the scariest, that's but if she casts her commander, I, My I mean... Pretty scary too. Right, I, I think I know what I'm talking about. Okay. I can't believe this common land is actually coming into play. Let's see it. Hmm. Uh, Skyline Cascade. Oh my god. I will target... <laughs> The gold span uh, enters the target creature and the opponent controls doesn't untap during its controller's next Get tap him. step. So I, you, you never make a, that you do make a so treasure good. though, right? Nope. Uh, oh. That's an ability, not a spell. Yeah. Oh, okay. Played around. Oh, right, right. Yeah. Nice. You knew the whole time. I've Sweet. literally never seen that card. Be so good. I know. <laughs> Ever. I, I usually take it out of the deck when I see it, but I was like, hey, I'll keep it and maybe it'll do something. That's amazing. But I, I am going. To pass. All across the world, that card's value went from five cents to ten. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> that does not untap. It sure doesn't. Sad. It does not. Okay. Could you sign that and give it to me, actually? I love it. <laughs> After the game. I probably have more. <laughs> Perfect. It's a common. Tapping five to cast Asian. Commander's back. Commander's back. I will trigger Sunscorch region. I gain a life. <coughs> and it gets plus one, plus one. I got you on the life. I'm glad you don't have the extra combat guy still. <laughs> yeah. You guys are welcome. <laughs> <laughs> All the thanks I get. Uh, <laughs> Alicia says power two or less, so it can get the ankle shanker. <laughs> <laughs> the ankle shanker. <laughs> Not my ankles, too. Here you. Ben. Yes, hi. Would you like to form an Ooh. alliance? That is quite a hefty amount of life that what? CGB's got. However, 
I am very scared of your attack triggers. I'll form an alliance with you. I, <laughs> that's a great alliance. <laughs> Not even when you're dead. <laughs> that's true. You know what? Um, a betrayal I will not forget. I mean, let's see. You got those gobbles, too. You got four. Don't do it, Ben. I mean, I know. Seven. She's actually being nice about it. She kind of holds your life in her 13. hand because she could she just does. probably kill you. Well, she so. do 13. Some, I mean, she probably has like a lightning bolt or something, but I'm not sure. How about. How about we don't form a I Kill me! I mean, kill me! I, I, I can't believe Ben's even like. I mean, I, what kind of question is this? It's yes or die! <laughs> She's being polite. Okay. She said, yeah, like, fair. join yeah. me or die. Okay, yes, it's like yes. the hardest decision you made all game. Yes. <laughs> Do I die or no? <laughs> Take it from someone who's done. <laughs> Take the deal. I would prefer yeah. you just stand up to her, you know? Don't, No, don't. no, I'm good. I'm good. I will, I will ally with the double attack triggers. Oh, no. Okay. So. Yeah, that's entirely in my benefit. What am I talking about? <laughs> I'm like, yeah, I'm, a, I'm good at 14 health. You know? I think it's like, I didn't expect it to end that yeah. way. <laughs> I don't know. I, I, you could say no because if she wanted to attack you, she'd just do it. The, the fact that, that she true. offers the deal that means she is, yes. doesn't want to. Yeah, That's true. But, I mean, what it is, it, it's and, what it is. Yeah. I wouldn't want to make yeah. her mad either, but it's your call. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Final yeah. answer? Okay. Yes, final okay. answer. We have a deal. Okay. <laughs> We're just gonna go so. for it here. We're just gonna go for it. Okay. This has summoning sickness. I will move to my attack step. Uh huh. I'm gonna swing everything. Uh huh. At CGB. Okay. Um. So, I guess. One trigger here is that um, whenever Alicia, who smiles at death attacks, you may pay two. If you do, return target creature card with power two or less from your graveyard to the battlefield, tap to attack you. All right, two triggers. Um, yes, and then the other trigger. Oh no, this one double triggers. I don't oh, know if right. you have two things or the mana to use it, but it double triggers. You also Actually, have a... I don't get my exile and... Um... This is a good double. Layout, though. Oh, right, yeah, when it attacks. Yep, exile, okay. Yeah, you don't have enough black or white to. Oh wait, right. doesn't this sack for two? It does sack. Yeah, yeah, so you do. You can pay for both. I could if you wanted to. Yes. If you should. I'd probably stack it though to do this first. Yeah. Okay, so yeah, we'll do that first. Okay. more. Okay. And then one more. Right. It says you may play that card this turn. <clears throat> so if you haven't played a land, you'll be able to play one of these. And that gets plus two plus one plus one counters. Thank you. Anytime. <laughs> okay. So that, and then now we've got Alicia, and I will pay two here. We're gonna return ankle ankle shanker. Not, not my ankles. Look out for your ankles. Hey, it doesn't trigger at least. Not my ankles. That might be the most expensive thing I've seen Alicia get back. Yeah, that is. Uh, yeah, no kidding. Fire although Agent of Treachery would be good, but that's a different. Oh, oh Jesus! Yeah, that'd be. Gross. That's mm -hmm. a different. Day. I'm glad my ankles are safe. Okay. Um, yeah, so, anything else to get back off the second trigger? Do you have another two power or less thing in the graveyard? I do not. Okay, so this is the attack. This is the attack. Well, uh, that ankle shanker gets to stick around though, so it gets to be part of the next attack. Uh, mm -hmm. oh, I guess I can block it, right? It's only two. I can put that in the way. Mm. All right, yeah. Then I'm going to block the ankle shanker with the sun scorch region, and the two four fours will block this three two and this three two. Okay. And I'll take nine. Five. Yeah. Nine. Yep. Nine. I'm a little afraid you don't. She, she has mana. But yeah, yeah, we're just gonna stick with those blocks. Okay, I think before damage, I'm gonna try something. Okay. We will sacrifice this to add a planes and tap a red. It's adding two mana, just so you know. Oh, 
Okay, so could I do? Like it has to be the different. same color. Yeah. Okay, well, I need two different colors. Yeah, just so you know. Okay, so this will be for planes. This for a red. One floating plane. Boros charm, making oh. my creatures indestructible. It was all part of the plan. Oh man. Uh, trigger Sunscorch Regent. I gain a life and gets another plus one plus one. And that that resolves. That your creatures are indestructible. And I don't think I took my nine yet, right? Nope. No. No. Nope. Right. Okay, so I'm I'm still gonna take my nine and your creatures don't die. Okay. Ooh. All right, but now if I draw a board wipe, maybe I can get out of this. Oh yeah, the yeah, treasure. You have one floating. Uh, no, it was in the combat. Oh right, right, it's right, gone. right, right. Yeah. It's gone now. Um, but I think I can cast or play Urborg, Tomb of Yagma. Urge Borg. Yep. Urge Borg Tomb. Okay, cool. Cool. And then this will go to exile, and that will conclude. Really thought I was gonna get the the death touch in first strike. That would have been yeah. pretty spicy. Magic's got some uh, interesting interactions sometimes. I'll play Storm Carve Coast. I can't block kind of anything you do unless I do something about the ankle shanker. <laughs> I know. Such a funny name. <laughs> I Dude, know. Shanker. I remember when that was My in ankles school. are very concerned. <laughs> it's, a, it's a goblin. Ankles berserker. back on the menu, boys. <laughs> It's a goblin berserker. Berserker. <laughs> oh my goodness. Berserker. It's off. He's the out chain. for those ankles. That really speaks to me. <laughs> goblin berserker. <laughs> I bet. <laughs> Shay, your only untapped creature is your commander, a 3 4. Yeah. Poor Shanker. Your power on board, assuming not too much changes. This would trigger twice. That's 7. 10, 13, 17, 18, 19, 20, 3, 26. And that's assuming Ben doesn't find some way to really nasty help you. But Ben made a deal. Like, I, yeah. I can almost kill him. <laughs> and. Almost, though. I, oh, <laughs> I, I, I think I'm a little. The trash talk. It's so close. <laughs> I think I can almost murder him, but alas. But alas, it's just really tough because I can yeah. go after her and try to make it a race because I can't block right. her. But then I'm in so the corner. So holding back does me no good. Just like. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> that. Still you're, just, you're just over there doing that. And you get a tutor next turn with the journal. Dude, so yeah, that's, that's really dangerous. That's the first time that card has like done work for me. Hey, I was there. It, did, it was yeah, pretty good. Yeah, yeah. Got you something good. Keep in mind, you're this is a, yes, flash. It's a they, two -two. they do have flash. <laughs> so I don't have a great attack with my soul fire. Which is really annoying. <laughs> uh, it's a really tough spot. Um, but I've got to do something, and sitting back doesn't do it. So we're going to pay six mana. Cast Hinata, Dawn Crowned. I will respond. Don't mess with his stuff. Okay. <laughs> I will tap one okay. and I will wash it away. Counter target spell that wasn't cast from your, the owner's hand. I'll trigger Sunscorch Regent. Gain one life. Ben's playing Kingmaker Ooh. over here. <laughs> Queenmaker. If that happens, can I still even compete in this game? Or am I just... Kind of out. Although that does. Now that triggers a Sun Scorch region. Now I'm a point closer to killing Ben. <laughs> Fair <laughs> enough. Yeah. Seven. Yeah, I didn't calculate that. Indeed. All right. That that gets countered. Okay. That gets countered. All right. You had to do that, Ben. I, I did. Actually. You had to do that. Actually, didn't. I don't know. <laughs> Technically. <laughs> All right. I'll cast Bright Dragon. Flying no. haste. haste yeah. <laughs> when I cast a non-creature spell, plus one, plus one counter, I'll attack Ben with everything. Okay. Um, I think I live by like one. I'll block if I block. That well, is. if you block the 4-4, four, four, yeah. you take 7, 11, 13, 14. <sighs> oh. Okay, in that case, before blocks, I will tap 2 and sack a clue to draw a card. <laughs> Okay. Yeah. <laughs> What's your zero mana get out of this? 
card. <laughs> you don't have back to negation. I will block a 4-4. Four, four. Oh. Okay. And... And die. <laughs> and die. I gain, I gain two from Soulfire. Welcome. <laughs> Welcome. Good to be here. And, yeah, it's, it's something. And I... It's you and me again. Oh my god. And I'm tapped out. Have... You got... Can you deal 41? Your turn. You should get a ban hat for whoever dies first. <laughs> He had to do it. I he did. had to do that. I didn't so think messed he would up. Have a he had to put me in that spot. That's so messed up. So should we be looking for a guest for next week? <laughs> <laughs> I might not. Depends make, on a trip, guys. <laughs> I might not make it back. Shay might knock me into next week. <laughs> My hands are so sweaty. Okay. These weak arms are heavy. <laughs> yes. Mom, spaghetti. Oh, delicious. <laughs> Ooh. Well, that tensions are high. No, I'm good. <laughs> You're hard dead. <laughs> so am I. Why is it always me and you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Gives me a tummy ache every time. <laughs> oh, <It's... laughs> oh, too much that... pressure. Mm -hmm. She's been the spot You're doing before. Great. <laughs> You're good. And she's come out ahead more times <laughs> than I'd like to admit. <sighs> Did you gain your two life off Soul Fire Grandmaster? Uh huh. I wouldn't miss that. I <laughs> know. I'm on your team game? here, so. This is game like 16 life or something. Or something I'm absurd. sure the comments below will be able well, to tell us. When you add Magma Opus and oh, Brutal Explosion, right, yeah. like, I've probably gained 40 Thousand. life. Yeah. First, I will tap two for Ketus, Emberclaw Familiar. Whenever a commander you control deals combat damage to an opponent, it deals that much damage to each other opponent. <laughs> Taste it, you two. Oh. <laughs> oh. I'm going to trigger a Sunscorch region and gain a life draw. Uh, gain Ooh. one life and get bigger. Yeah, I don't like that. What, was it worth it? <laughs> Probably not. Honestly. Storm count one, though. No. Yeah, there you go. I think my best bet here is to attack with all and really hope my exile... Trigger pulls through for me. Okay. Okay. Do you have any? Do you have any other creatures in the graveyard that are like two power? You don't, right? I think I asked that last turn. I'm just. Nope. Okay. They are both three power. Okay. Well, so for stuff has been exiled. I'm a little uncomfortable with the angle shrinker being so close to me. I'm gonna move. <laughs> you, you like the gold span a little better, don't you? It's fine. Dragons are cool. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Ankle shankers. I got oh, my man. ankle shanked <laughs> last so turn. My, my it ankles. wasn't pleasant. <laughs> all right, so yep, yeah, we're gonna attack with all. This is my third ankle shanking. Yeah, I didn't dude. know I had a third ankle to <laughs> shank. <laughs> um. Okay, triggers. You have a goldspan dragon trigger, and you have a uh, Laylila. Laylia. Laylia. Oh, yes. And they're double triggers. They are yeah, double so you triggers. Get two treasures. Two treasures. Fancy. Which is four total mana, jeez. You're a treasure. Oh, thanks. Aww, yeah, dude. So sweet. You're a clue, Blake. Okay. <laughs> Always a mystery. You're a shrine. <laughs> I'm an illusion. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> At best, you're an elemental. All right. Yes. Are, we, are we doing exile triggers? We're doing exile triggers. <laughs> this is a big deal. Yeah, oh. Oh, that's Embercleave? Oh, no way. No. Oh my gosh. Nice. Not Embercleave. Nice. Anything but Embercleave. <laughs> nice. Is it two? Do you, are, is it two exiles? Two. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Yeah. I do get two exiles. See you later. Do another one. What's the next one? Soul oh, Ring. Soul Ring. Okay. okay. And there's counters on that for exiling, I Correct. think. Correct. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So that thing's now a seven. That's your biggest thingy. And so, um, I have no blocks. Yeah. Any, you, can, you got any yeah. effects? This would be, I can do Ember, can I do Ember? I can do that That's now. Okay. You sure okay. can. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, kind yeah. of the good thing about it. It only costs yeah, you two mana. Yeah. See, look it's at her use totally Flash, fine. dude. Yeah, She's I know. Using I mean, it. She believes in Flash, I don't know. Okay, for each attacking creature you control. Wow. So Truly you are amazing. casting Embercleave. Mm -hmm. For two mana. I will. For zero. Oh! Yeah. <gasps> Trigger my Sunscorch region and gain mm -hmm. one life. Okay, bury the leaf. Go mm -hmm, on. Mm -hmm. And I will cast Pact of Negation oh! targeting Embercleave. And I'll draw a card from the Whirlwind of Thought and put a counter on my Sprite Dragon. Nice. 
I, yep, don't have anything I can, um, I can do about that. I'm really glad no. I didn't oh use that to goodness. resolve my head on yeah. yes. <laughs> Wow. How much damage? Oh my gosh. Yeah, how okay. much damage is this? Yes, yeah, so we got um, four, seven, nine, um, 12, 13, 16, 19, and seven makes 26. 26. 26. Okay. Is that more than half? <laughs> Thank you. Two, one. No. Wow. Okay. Oh. Yikers. I just have to deal 35. Uh, you also get a second combat step to arrange some defenses. So Second main turns, phase. Second main phase, sorry. Yep. Turn's not done yet. You scared me for a second. Yeah, I was like, wait. Scared myself. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, all I can think about is combat. <laughs> um, he used to be a blue mage. I mean, I guess I, I guess I can. Um, I can one can only have their ankles shanked so many true. times. <laughs> one for oh, soul ring. I don't know where to put it. Okay. Yeah. Uh, trigger. E Go up to eighteen. I keep forgetting about that thing. Yeah. It's so. getting close to yeah, murdering you. Yeah, it's, big it's, it's not too good. You must really like that soul ring. It's not too good. <laughs> Okay, let me see if I can do anything creative here that I'm not thinking of. I really don't mm. think so. <laughs> Those cards well, in hand. Yeah, an ankle shanker. She's hit every land drop. They yeah. could be lands. You got a final punishment by chance. <laughs> That's a good card. I love that card. That's it for me. That's my turn. Okay. Whew. Yeah, that was, wow. Still I'm here. I'm sweating. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a helper. Upkeep. Oh, he doesn't yeah, pay. Just right dies. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, going to, not to pay. I'm paying for this <laughs> freaking pact, okay? I'm paying. It's paying. There, I can't believe there's been no board wipes in this game. This would yeah. be a great time to top deck one, let me right, tell you. Man, okay. I've got my Supreme Verdict mana right here. Come on. One time. Not Supreme Verdict. <laughs> I will play Reliquary Tower. Red, white, one colorless. I'm gonna cast this new card that I thought would just be fun. Right now I really wish it was something else. <laughs> this is uh, Iganjo Uprising. So create X-2-2 two, two white samurai creature tokens with vigilance. They gain menace and haste until end of turn. Each opponent creates X minus one 2-2 two, two white samurai creature tokens with vigilance. I want you to have any, so I'm just paying one. So I get a 2-2 two, two, Menace, Haste, Vigilant Samurai token. We trigger Sprite Dragon, and we trigger Whirlwind of Thought. So this gets counter and a draw card. I really needed that to be a good one. It looks like it might be time to start chumping these frickin' ankle shanking things. Because <laughs> I don't know another way that I'm gonna get out of this. I can't quite deal you 35. I have t 21. This has haste and it has menace. You have one blocker, it's a 1-1. One, one. Mm -hmm. I could also attack you with the regent just to try to get you in range. But the regent can block the gold span dragon, which would... Have first strike death. Have first strike and death touch. Oh, okay, so I should mm -hmm. do that. Shay, I'm going to attack you. I'm attacking with Sunscorch Regent, Soulfire Grandmaster, and this has Vigilance and Haste and Menace Samurai token. Okay. Mm -hmm. You never know. It might make the difference if I attack with it <laughs> next turn. It might. So I will do no blocks. Okay. And so, so I will take... 14. 14. And I gain two. Your turn. Ooh, okay. More land, maybe? Another Embercleave, perhaps? <laughs> There's only one Embercleave. It's true. There can only be one. Paying four for Revenge of Ravens. 
Oh, oh God. Silly. That's oh, silly. God. Adding salt to the wound. Oh, God. <laughs> that's silly. So whenever I attack you, my... I, I lose you, a life. Yes, whenever a creature attacks you or a planeswalker you control, that creature's controller loses one life and you gain one life. Okay. But it's tr- doubled by Ishin, so it'd be two and two. And it's yes. for every creature. <laughs> yes, okay, oh so it's two life and attacker. Okay, that's Maybe gonna be our race. I trigger my Sunscorch Regent. Yeah. I gain one. <laughs> it's 21 to 21, Shay. Whoa. 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 Okay. Um. <sighs> okay. Let's uh, let's do some math here. So twenty-eight. Uh oh. <laughs> no, I'm just oh. I'm just looking for a flashback card that wins mm. a game, and I don't see it. <laughs> <laughs> and you could block four of it. I think we're just gonna. We're gonna full send it. Yeah, <laughs> we're gonna just full send. send it. Full send. So even even your little one even one in the corner, yes. everything we attacks. We are gonna risk it for the biscuit, and we're gonna see what's gonna happen. I am attacking you with everything. Uh huh. <laughs> Thank you, Ben. Yeah, no Thank problem. You. Didn't want this guy to get left out. Triggers. Triggers. Um. Don't have any targets for this. Um, I will exile. Okay. What is that? Selfless samurai. <laughs> Whenever a samurai or warrior you control attacks alone and gains life link until end of turn, I can sacrifice it. Another target creature you control gains indestructible until end of turn. I'm okay with this. You're good with that. Okay. Next one. <sighs> okay. It's another land. Not what I was hoping for. All right, Goldspan Dragon makes you treasures. Goldspan Dragon does give me... Keep in mind, Lelia goes up by two. And Lelia goes up by two. So we are at seven here. Okay. Time for the math. And Ankle Shanker triggers. Yes, so first strike and death touch. Should have Good been like goodbye. <laughs> All the shanks. All the shanking. Shanking the ankles that aren't there anymore. We're definitely going to block this this nine nine. That makes sense. It doesn't trample. This is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, plus three is eleven, plus three is fourteen, plus two is sixteen, plus four is twenty. I could go to one. <laughs> then I can't even attack back if I do that. Yeah. Or can I? Oh, it is deep. She killed me. <laughs> You got this, dude. I don't blame you. This game, Shay is my queen. I helped her. <laughs> <laughs> 21. So this is... This is 11, 15, 19, 22, 20. Okay. Oh my gosh. And you still get another combat you drew. Main phase. Yeah, sorry, I keep saying that. You get another main phase. <laughs> yep. You drew. You played the Revenge of Ravens. You had the mana to play it last turn, so that's what you drew off the top. You're going to have a Selfless Samurai. So the cards in your hand are either super sneaky or they're not very good. I'm going to block the 9-9 with the Samurai, and I'm going to find another thing. I guess the next biggest thing is the Dragon. So I'm going to block the Gold Span Dragon with the Sprite Dragon. Who doesn't yeah. live up to expectations? Yeah, that gold spin is batting down. Then, uh, right. so I'm allowing through one, two, three, <coughs> four, five. Oh wait, sorry, this goes over here. Game front. All right. Too many cards. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Plus four is twelve. Plus four is sixteen. Going to five. That's what I think is happening. So yep. does all that resolve? Yes. All right, my things die. Your things don't die. And I go to five. Okay, so this swap, exile, and then I will tap two for my selfless samurai. Gain a life. <sighs> <laughs> it's now a 12 Boom. power Sunscorch region. 
Okay. Pass the turn. I will. Okay. Yoda? I will. Is that you? <laughs> okay. Pass the turn. I will. I need yeah. all the wisdom. <laughs> Am I now I'm yet? picturing of Shay just like hopping on someone's back and just. <laughs> <laughs> I might have you. <laughs> what? But if you have any sneaky stuff, I don't. So I'm gonna play this island. Awesome. Yep, <laughs> it is a gorgeous island. And that's it. He wins. <laughs> <laughs> I have this artifact and this enchantment. This is still a four-four elemental. It's one of these. So I'm going to. Six mana. I'm going to cast Banish into Fable. This is an instant. When you cast this spell from your hand, copy it if you control an artifact, then copy it if you control an enchantment. You may choose new targets for the copies. Okay. Return target non-land permanent to its owner's hand. Create a 2-2 white knight creature with vigilance. So I'm going to return your Revenge of Ravens to your hand. I'm going to return your selfless mm. samurai to your hand. And uh, because... I get one more effect anyway. I'm also going to return Lelia? Lelia? Lelia. Lelia to your hand. <laughs> I'm going to trigger the whirlwind of thought and draw a card. Come up with a new name every time you say it. Like, you got Lydia, you got Lillian. Lily. It's a different person every time. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, that does resolve. Okay. 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 I really scared That's a good you to have turn. something. Yeah, that was a. Perfect. All right. I'm going to attack you for 12, 16, 22. Just consult real quick. Maybe you care to share what's in your hand if you are dying. Otherwise, because I gotta know one way or another. I need to know: Am I dead? What's in your hand? What's in your hand? <sighs> you have how many cards? One, two, three, four, five. You five return cards, three. Five cards. So, yeah, three, three of them we know. All right, yes. got two unknowns. Two unknowns. I don't. I don't have any responses here. No. Oh. Yeah. So, so that's lethal. That's lethal. What's in your oh, hand? What's in your hand? Yes, you're saying Okay, that. so we have an Orzhov Signet, yeah. a Nomad Post, Selfless Samurai. We, didn't we return that Orzhov Signet forever ago? Yeah. I, I totally forgot that. about yeah, it. Yeah, me too. Yeah, me too. It's, it's been like totally 50 turns. She's been holding it back, yeah. just playing mind games oh. with me this whole time. <laughs> you could have played that and Same you just... Mm. with this, I was like, I could play it, but we'll try to keep some mystery. Oh, man. Wow. That was good. Wow. That was well thought. <laughs> I, I beat Shay in a 1v1. <laughs> I, I got scared that history was going to yeah, repeat. So I, I had Sublime Epiphany, but oh, I man. never mm. had this. Right. Like, I didn't have six mana last turn. I didn't have two six mana this turn. So if you had, like, an Angelic Grace or something like that or Settle the Wreckage, I would have just been dead. <laughs> Otherwise, I had, you know, a dragon that was six. I I was showing yeah, my hand to him that so turn. Sad. And I had five. I had <laughs> all these six the drops and lands. Uh, this I just drew off the thing. Uh, so that's the game. Um, wow. We laughed, we wow. cried, yeah. Ben and I died. Good good fight, wow. Shay. That was epic at the end. That was awesome. And you guys both scared the crap out of me. I guess we should declare our cards of the game. So, Blake, card of the game. River's Rebuke. <laughs> Why, thank you, sir. Very sporting to acknowledge the River's Rebuke. Whatever, dude. <laughs> yeah, that, that was, was a river. A good it uh, did some work. It did the thing. I think we were all about to lose. Is that a fair assessment? Oh, like, yeah, of your it's going to destroy level? you guys. <laughs> if I untapped, you were all so dead. <laughs> oh, feels bad, man. Ben, what's your card of the game? I would say Pact of Negation. Or, or maybe Samuel's Journal, because it made me search for the Pact. And I'm glad it was... You had the Rebuke. I ha I drew it that turn. You so Oh my! <laughs> yeah, I was I drew it and I'm like I was thinking I was thinking maybe I should search for the cyclonic rift just in case 
And then I'm like, I'm gonna wait till I draw, smart. just to be sure. Smart play. And it was Rivers Rebuke. I'm like, okay, I'm good. I might have missed that. That's a smart play. <laughs> so I was like, I'll just search for a zero mana counterspell. And <laughs> that's how the Rivers Rebuke resolved. And yep, the game exactly. continued. Wow. Yeah. Holy cow. And Blake got killed. I did. Well, you, you didn't Thanks do for it. The, rehash. the person yeah. who killed Blake yes. is the next person who's gonna <laughs> share their card of the game. So Shay, what you got? So I feel like there are a lot of good options, but only Come one on. yeah. speaks to my heart in this way, which is ankle shanker. Um, <laughs> no give me ankles. Amazing. I've got no ankles. I feel like there's really no other option for me. No, um, yeah. Yeah, that first strike and death touch. And just the spirit of the card. Of you course. know what I mean? Like, it's if so anyone sweet. at this table would shank someone's ankles, <laughs> for sure shank. <laughs> I mean, I can't deny that. I wear long socks anytime I'm around. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, so ankle shanker. All right. My card is a, a mythic from long ago, Soulfire Grandmaster. Mm. This mm. was the weirdest game that we've played in a long time with no board wipes, except for a one Rivers Rebuke, I guess, counts. Mm. But like, I know I'm playing Blasphemous Act and a bunch of other Same. cards. I know that it's pretty normal to see me casting board wipes. So it was weird, but this two mana, two, two lifelink was on the board for so long and probably gained me over 40 life when all was said and done between <laughs> The Magma Opus that we cast twice because of it, um, just getting the free attacks. And obviously I would have been completely dead if it had been almost any other two drop. So far Grandmaster hits the showers after the game like, whoa, oh my god. <laughs> Michael Jordan <laughs> just carried the team to a title, man. Oh my goodness. All right. So uh, that's the show. Thanks a lot for playing, guys. You who watched, you're one of an elite special group. Did you know that less than 20% of viewers actually make it till the end? That's why you are very cool. And I, as a two-time, I'm the two-time now, winner of the game, oh. I will be picking the comment that I like the most to receive a Cool Stuff, Inc. gift card. So, thanks everybody, and thank you, you guys. And as always, you are cool. <laughs>